the loss of a local legend. The name Stanford White will always be paired with Douglas Trojan football here in Oklahoma City. But his family says he was so much more than a coach. He was someone they could lean on, someone they could depend on, look up to, and kind of aspire to to be. The field bears his name. He coached the Trojans for nearly 30 seasons and led them to a championship in 1976. His heart was not just on the field, but also in the classroom and shared with the lives he touched in the community. Going with him during the summertime, the football practice, being there at six in the morning, go to weightlifting, and then just going to summer pride. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's just mainly just watching him and what being a part of like a big tradition, like it was so, it was such a, like looking back on it, like moments I'll cherish forever. His son and grandson shared about the legacy Stanford White leaves behind. The legacy he did establish is going to continue on and knowing that the impact that he made and left in the community will live on beyond him uh, without question. Uh, we can't do nothing but be proud of him, what he's done. We also have heard from former players and students. Reverend DeAndre Foster told us he's grateful for the outstanding coaching he received from Coach White. He's more thankful for the black history, the black pride, and black confidence Coach instilled in him as a young African-American man, saying, quote, yes, he is the winningest coach in Douglas history, but that winning mentality came with so much more. We have to continue on and continue to to do the things that we learned and were taught to do and um, and continue to just uh, carry on his, his uh, legacy and the things that he uh, aspired to do for the community and, um, and, and just continue to go on, keep going forward.